Here we go, Mr. Russ. Howdy, howdy. Hey, sweetheart, how are you, sir? Dude, she. That's, that's him folding in half right there. Right? Like, Pushing 10. Look how beautiful he is. Look at that color. Oh my god. <laughs> is everyone doing on this fine day all right so today we're just taking care of the snake room feeding some things everybody's got to eat of course all the time shuteed watch this ready you ready for some live action Woo! 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 you see that dude she comes she is such a savage this snake comes flying out of the cage mouth wide open she is so intense get a good shot of this look at that Holy crap, dude. So sick. Look at this. Dude, she is such a freaking beast, bro. But we're gonna get that. We're gonna put that rat right there. Nice and her. We'll safely close her gate. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You gotta be real careful with her. Whoa. All right, let's go this way. Get this. Oh, my God. Get that cage nice and closed and everybody's safe. Man, she gets your heart going. It's crazy. So, today. Like I said, we're just feeding some animals. I try to give her, dude, as soon as she eats, she poops, I feed her again. I'm just trying to pump her to get her to size so that way she gets nice and big like her buddy Rusty, her boyfriend Rusty, her boyfriend, her sister, her, uh, her, what, what is it called? Her, her brother husband. That's what it is, her brother, husband. I know, we're going to be lion breeding these snakes. A lot of people were asking me questions about it. They were like, oh, you said they're from the same clutch. Isn't that bad to do? Yeah, with a lot of other animals, you do have complications and stuff like that with dogs. Humans, obviously, you don't want to do that unless you live, like, in the Bible Belt. Okay, we're not going to go there. Um, anyways, but lion breeding is something that we do in the reptile world to keep these characteristics of these snakes going. So we have Rusty that is like a high orange male. And then we have his sister Shatid. She also has a lot of orange in her. So to keep that orange, instead of muddying it out with a different King Cobra that might not be as orange as she is. See how nice and orange her hood is, how nice and light her body is. Same thing with my dude Rusty. Nice orange hood, really smooth, light colored body with those light colored chevrons that go all the way through in between their scales so in order to keep those characteristics we do something called line breeding that way everything kind of stays a little bit similar for the most part so without further ado i still gotta feed a couple things these eastern albino rattlesnakes have a couple big days ahead of them i know they're really hard for you guys to see because it's down below but i'm on a stool right now but these guys need to be fed today, so I'm going to feed them real quick. Rusty, Rusty has super gross poops in his cage. So we definitely got to clean Rusty's cage out because he just pooped from that big python. His poops in his water bowl. His water bowl is disgusting. We're going to get him nice and situated here as well. And uh, we're going to do some king cobra handling with Alex today too. That's pretty much the main, the main goal of this video. Alex show you guys his uh, his king cobra handling skills so your boy alex over here pepe what did you do we're sending in some paperwork we're finally making, we're making some things happen folks yes finally so alex has been with me for a couple years now you guys know this yeah. um he's finished up his viper day colubra day and heliderma so those three families out of the five that I have, so Alex has three classes now that he's done a thousand hours each for. So we're sending those into FWC, but he still has to work on a lapidae. Lapids are his number one thing that we need to still work on. Yeah, the Viper Day, the rattlesnakes you got down, the vipers you got down, the Gaboon you got down, the heat the monsters you got down. A false water cobra, even though it's technically not unless you got down. Okay. So now, cobra stuff. Even though King Cobra, Ophia Goddess Hannah, not a true cobra. 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 I can't pronounce things correctly. So. 
Time to take him out. That's gross. Yeah. Gross! All right. Yeah. Ew! Pooped in the water bowl. Yeah. Poop in the water bowl is like the worst. Ooh. I hate poop in the water bowl. Ooh. Ooh. I drove past a two day old roadkill gator yesterday and it didn't touch this. Gross. This is brutal. All right, Senior Pee Pee, time to shine. Let's get Rusty out the cage. Put him in that trash can behind you. Now, here we go. Nice boy. Now you're lucky he's a gentleman. I know. I probably should have approached the snake. That's all right. Here we go, Mr. Russ. Howdy, howdy. All right. Into the bin he goes. Good job. Lid. The lid, lid, the lid, Patrick, the lid. Lid, done. Beep, like a glove. Nice. There's some poopies in there. Let's get it nice and clean for him. All right, so while Alex is taking care of that poopy situation over there, let me just show you guys how this Insularis cage is doing. So this is that new cage that I got from Leap. I made a video on it. Uh, maybe like a week or so ago now, but dude, check out how this thing is doing. So all these plants are doing incredible. I put all the isopods in here last week with the soil, the sphagnum moss, live planted tank. Look at that guy up there. He's just having a great, let's open this up real fast to take a better look at him. Hey, sweetheart, how are you, sir? Woo, look at them. Just doing great. This cage is super cool with all the pinks and the greens. Absolutely beautiful. The other one is down there. See see that little blue in the corner? Like right over there. He's down there chilling, hanging out. But these guys are doing fantastic. This cage is beautiful, man. I love the pinks and the reds. And then even the background here with like, it looks like the sun's coming through. So cool. Leap did such a great job with this cage. Thank you guys so much. I love the panel in the front. Make sure we... Make sure we lock this, guys. Boop, boop, boop. I still have to put an actual fixed lock on here, but besides that, this thing is great. Mr. Wildcaught Eastern. He's just being Wildcaught Eastern. He's still a little skinny. I've been feeding him a lot, but he's skinny. Gabby, she is in the shed. I got the copperhead down here. He's being really cool, too. And then we still have... There's a snake down here, and there's, oh, you almost saw it. There's a snake down there, too. Ooh, you can't see. Yeah, so you guys need to stay tuned for that video. Oh, dude, I got so much cool stuff coming out for you guys. It's awesome. We're working real hard. But the bottom of here, soon, probably the next video we're going to make, actually, yeah, we're going to make a video making a new enclosure for the snake that's on the bottom. One of my freaking favorites. I'm looking for a female right now. I got a baby male. Dude, stunner. Stunner, stunner, stunner. Can't wait to show you guys what that is. Above it is another really cool snake. Not gonna show you yet until we make an enclosure for it. Those are just temporary enclosures. They're babies. So they can be in those smaller cages until they get a little bit bigger. This whole rack system right here, we're gonna make this all rattlesnakes. So all of the rattlesnakes in this room are gonna be right here in this rattlesnake tower. It's gonna be really cool. And just make it easier to manage them. Except for my big rattlesnakes. My big rattlesnakes are gonna stay down there but all the other rattlesnakes are going on this tower. That is gonna be really cool, so stay tuned for that video as well. What, are you ready to put them back? Okay, well, Whatever, man. I guess we're just ready out. to go back. Let's um, let's show these guys some hook safety. Let's take him out with a hook maybe, you know yeah. what I mean? Put him back with the hook, show these guys how to properly take these animals out of the enclosure, put them back in the enclosure, not so free handy, even though, you know, he's rusty and we can do that with him. But yeah. let's pretend like Rusty is super mean like and Rusty we need to get him back in the cage perfect. right now. All right. Yeah. yeah. Let's pretend Rusty is Shatid. Don't die. Oh, hello, sweet girl. She just ate a rat. Hello, baby mama. All right. Sorry. Hey, man. Sorry. I got distracted. I'm not mad at that. She she's real that. pretty. She that thing down fast. fast. I just fed her a large rat. So she's really happy right now. She, so. And she slammed it. Slammed it down. Yeah. No problem. Rusty's like, dude. What are you doing to me? Mm -mm -mm. Look how thick he is, man. He really is. He's a monstrous. He is a thick boy. 
Thicky Mickey. Look at that. He is a big boy. Woo! Ooh. Dude. She. That's, that's him folding in half right there. Right? Like, Pushing 10. Pushing 10. Almost 11. Pushing we 10. need to really measure him soon. Maybe we can make a video all on its own measuring Rusty and how you can measure a snake. Because obviously, a snake you can't just like pull out completely straight and measure. You got to use the old rope trick. Can't really lay down right next to a king cobra. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's that's. Look how big he is. He's huge. He's awesome. Hey, Russ. Sir. How are you, sir? How are you, sir? Hey. Let me give you a little pet. His head is getting so big. I know. His scales on his head. You're so handsome, dude. Oh, sorry. He's like a full-on adult king cobra, basically. I know. He is amazing. One day, one day you will be a father. Oh, look how beautiful he is. Let's just take a second to appreciate him. Look at those scales. See the chevrons right through him. Hello, sir. Are you smelling around? You want some food or something? Yes? Yes? Don't try to bite me. Thank you. Don't strike. All right, let's get him put away. See? Look at that. Ah, oh, see? There we go. You know what I would do, honestly? I would just take the trash can, put it over by his cage, let him crawl back into his cage. That's probably the easiest thing to do right now, just because he's gonna wanna go through that first. So yeah, move the trash can, or the retaining receptacle over there. Put him in his cage. There you go, Russ. There we go, nice, he's nice, nice. He's, he's like, oh, okay, that's my cage. Look how beautiful he is. Look at that color. Oh my God. What a handsome man. What a handsome fella. All right, that's it. See you later, sir. Look at you, you get all feisty when you're in your cage. Oh, what a beautiful cage. Look at that. So nice and clean now. Perfect. For them, everybody loves watching a snake drink. Look at that. King Cobra drinking. It's so cute when snakes drink, I think. Watching them suck up that water. Look at that. So freaking cute. Here you go, buddy. That's it. Killed it. Killed Fed it. the snakes. Shateed. Still a shateed all the time. Quite. Fed the, fed the rattlesnakes. The other shateeds. Rusty does not eat it. Eat for the next couple of days. We should probably thaw him out something soon. Um, feed him again. Normally, I like to wait for him. I give him a nice big meal, let him digest it, poop, give him a few days to get it all, get it all out of his system, and then it's time to pump, pump, pump him again. Get right back to it. False water cobra, big female. Oh, big she is. she just ate girl. a large rat. Boom. Look at that sweet girl back there crawling around. Oh, she's so. Well, that's it for today. Done. Done so. Easy peasy. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Um, guys, stay tuned. A lot of things happening. Mm -hmm. Hognose snakes, more hognose snakes. We're gonna do hognose videos soon. Mm -hmm. Who wants that? I need to. Uh, I need to name a bunch of them. Some of them have names. Some of them don't have names. I'm waiting for the rack system soon. That we're gonna set up in the closet. I gutted out the closet the other day. Reorganized everything. We're trying to get more organized in here and more on top of everything. So stay tuned for all that. I'll teach you guys how we do it and how we keep track of everything and here. This is how we do it. We do it. I know everybody does things differently. That's why we like to share how we do things. Okay? Right? If you guys have any questions, concerns, recommendations, tips, drop them down below. You guys know the drill. Tyler Nolan Tattoos for all of your merch. Easy peasy. Bye, sure. I gotta go to work. So, we'll see y'all on the flip side. Stay tuned. Monitor Lizard video coming soon. Alex's house making cages. Coming soon. More breeding. New snake. Two new snakes. Y'all don't even know about me. But they never really understand me. I need a comma like I need a Grammy. She needs to flow with her designer panties. Yeah, we eating plenty. Check the pantry from the sound waves to the rebel lines from the tattered bridges to expensive dishes. Now we eating ends with these new beginnings. Yet to sign a major for the bank roll. But thank the Lord that it dies at penitentiary. Nice guy, but my inside is empty. Mighty flashy with a bird's eye. Scribble gems to get my pockets lined till I get arthritis. Which my heart is icy. Walking past the bouncer like I knew somebody. Queen, like hell cloudy. Or the poison ivy. But from like a stroller with a co-sign me. I don't even like me. No, I'm staring the mirror indifferent.